You may know of the Jennings Arcade as home to your favorite Italian restaurant, Favs, or as the long building with lots of sunroofs. But do you know why the building itself is called an arcade? Here's a hint, it has nothing to do with video games. Realize Bradenton sat down with the owner of Jennings Arcade, Mike Carter, of Carter Construction, for an architecture history lesson. My name is Mike Carter. Um, I acquired the Jennings Arcade in 1990 and have been the landlord to its tenant base ever since. An arcade is, is a building that has an interior open atrium and provides some um, light from above down through interior spaces. Well, natural lighting uh, is the preferred lighting for any environment. Um, in the atrium, the l natural light comes down from above, but then all of the individual units have windows looking into the atrium so that they can capture that natural light as well. This building was primarily set up for your smaller mom and pop shops, whether it be the lawyer, the dentist, or the flower shop. Jennings Arcade was built in 1926 by brothers C.W. and F.M. Jennings. It was a time of economic boom in Bradenton, and buildings were going up left and right. What makes Jennings Arcade stand out is its unique architecture, much of which has been preserved and restored. Personally, I like the terrazzo floors that are on the ground floor. They are original. Uh, when we were renovating the terrazzo, um, repair guy told me he could fix all the cracks and I'd never know they were there and I said don't touch the cracks they're part of the personality so we tried to keep and maintain or repurpose as much of the original materials as we could the community as a whole I think has returned to downtown because there's history 